What is going on everybody? This is Coach Phil, Coach Phil Reacts. I'm here with another video. Finally, the first game of the NFL season. I'm excited. I'm ready to see what's gonna happen between the Bills and the Rams. Got this video from Pro Football Vision. Shout out to you, my boy. I know you guys working hard, doing your thing, and allowing me to be able to react to these videos. And he got it out quickly. And I was wondering if he was gonna get it out soon so I can do this tonight. I told y'all, if you saw on the community tab, I was gonna post it for tomorrow on Friday. So just getting it out here now. Um, the matchup between the Bills and the Rams is kind of a funny one because everybody keeps talking about, oh, what happened last season with the Bills against the Kansas City Chiefs the 13 seconds against Patrick Mahomes offense and then the Bills defense falling apart. And then the Rams unveiling their banner and everything like that. Can they repeat? Honestly, I don't think they can repeat. I, I really don't think that they've lost too many vital pieces to their team. Uh, Andrew, Andrew Whitworth, they lost Odell Beckham, who's a good com, com, uh, compliment to Cooper Cup. And now Cooper Cup's gotta be the official number one receiver and make all the plays. So hopefully we see something from them. Oh, but they did pick up Bobby Wagner from the Seahawks because the Seahawks did one day. But again, this should be a good matchup. If this is your first time to the channel, run over there and subscribe, hit the notification bell, hit the comment section, do all that good stuff. Follow me on Instagram, CoachPhil425. Follow the Discord. We'll have the Discord down in the description as well as the original video uh, from Pro Football Vision. And without any further ado, let's just get right to it. Go from 25. Allen to the air and underneath Stephon. That matchup between Trevon Diggs and, and no, I'm sorry, Trevon Diggs. I'm sorry, uh, Stephon Diggs. <laughs> and Jalen Ramsey is going to be a good one. Because Jalen be talking so much trash. He dismembered the profile of Josh Allen a few years ago. So hopefully we'll see some good from uh, Stephon Diggs. All right, Stephon right there. Stephon Diggs, not. Find the pattern for Allen, who escapes and throws complete to the back. And Moss being clear. Just a little bit, and Play action. Boot, and he'll flip it wide open. The man who scored on the touchdowns in the playoffs, Gabe Davis. Touchdown hey, Gabe Davis football. is a cold piece, man. You gotta look out for that boy right there. Sam Martin is the holder. Allen perfect on the drive last year. Third and eight. Bills bring four. Stafford pumps, Ooh. reloads, and fires. And who else? Cooper Pup. We were stay Christian Benford. Jordan for it, or you say, All right, hey, is that Higby? Hi, Dane Jackson. A great job. Take it five, staff it back to the air with pressure. Von Miller in there. Oh, yeah, I forgot. They lost Von Miller to Von signed that big contract with Buffalo. Sorry, y'all. I've been so focused on doing CFL stuff. I've tried to keep up with the NFL stuff going on. The CFL is going on at the same time. And I've immersed myself in that. So finally seeing some American football is pretty good right now. Don't worry. I've been out the loop too long. Oh. 29 Allen. That one is intercepted. And it's not his fault. Second and 10. And Stafford going quick again. It's caught by Cup. His second. We all know Cooper's going to do his thing, but who's going to step up for the Rams on the receiving court? Crowder back to the 13. With a head of steam. Got a lot of it back. Nice return of almost 20 yards out near the 32. He's ace the test. Run game, run game. Runs, the Bills debut, James Cook, the return of Georgia lost the football. And the Rams say they gotta hold on to the ball, man. Second year back out of Florida State, Scott. And he runs into That's that's a lot of me and Oliver. Stanford going quick. Love him at Houston. Oh, picked off. Dave Jackson with it. They roll him down by contact at the 33. That's good. Good momentum shift. It looks that way. It throws instead to Gabe Davis. Right the left side. And once again, it's Hutton Diggs. Has a little room on its sideline. A 21-yard gain. To the Allen on fire. 14 Nasty. to 50. And one to each. Ooh. Moss sifting through the track. Come on, 71. You got to block somebody. Big Come on, man. Still keeps going. Third and four. Rams bring pressure. Allen fires incomplete. Trying to get it to Gabe Davis. Didn't reel it in, and the Bills field goal unit will come off. Operation clean, and sneaking it inside. Ooh, the that looked wise. For the field goal. 
It's 10 to nothing out of the gate here. This one's dangerously close to the sideline and goes out of bounds, so a mistake will give that was best field position of the night for drive four. Their own 40-yard line, Henderson will take it inside, and he'll move the pile for about four years on Tuesday. Watched him in practice. He's felt good and said he could make all the throws. Here he's got Ooh. space out of the pocket, and that ball is Punched out. In and out of the hands. It's up the top of your screen on third and six. Stafford strokes it, and it's a first down inside. The ghost territory at the 40. Yep, the same kind of luck. The game's going kind of slow right now. Okay, a lot of boots. And throws it to him. And Cup gets to the 30-yard line. And pick up. Wants to attack him with. The 30-yard line. Pressure up the middle. Got him. Down. Sack back at the 41. Jordan Phillips. God, that's a big man. Third and 14. They go quick again. Stafford finds space. And it's going to be short of the first down by a couple of yards. Play clock running down. But not out. Cup's got it. He is hit but pushed forward by his own teammate to get the first down. Jeff Shell after the first down. Darrell Henderson runs inside the 20. Big play Ooh. for the first time tonight for the Rams. The screen. Stafford looking that way. Throwing that way. Cup puts the toes down. In for the touchdown. Cooper Cup. You can't say anything bad about Cooper Cup, man. He's a ball. Nice goal. Self I've heard his story so many times, but it's such a good, warm story, man. Bills will take over at their own 25. Draw. On the inside kick, Devin Singletary with the carry for just a couple of yards. Close it out with possession here. Alan Fitch tries to take off, and it's stopped. Nothing in the middle there. He's bringing heat. Alan back shoulder throw. Beautiful <laughs> catch. Stephon takes again. Stephon. Bills have a couple of timeouts. Alan. Approach it in the middle, and it is pulled away and intercepted by Troy Hill. At the Bills 45, chased by Von Miller, shovels it forward, but incomplete. Yet that incomplete. wasn't the play. Three and four, Stafford fires high and incomplete. Stafford comes right back to cut. The 31 yard line. Cam Akers, the back, he comes and he gets hit. What Stuffed a job him. coming around by. Garonic in motion. Stafford on the boot. Stafford on the keep. Stafford first. He got some wheels. Robinson's at the bottom of the screen. Stafford's looking the other side. Stafford's looking up at the ceiling. Great pressure again. Phillips got in there. Flying. Stafford out quick to cut. Robinson got a block. Cut coming Where are you going? Vaughn Miller waiting for him. Loss of two. Vaughn just having a good time, man. I like to see that. Pounded. Perfect. Their ability to stop the run. Their general manager Miller pressures Stafford, who throws to Henderson inside. Check down. Just up there and take care of the pressure. Stafford couldn't take care of the snap, and they take care of him. Got a block. And Singletary, good opening and a nice run by Singletary. Second and nine. Allen's going to keep it. Design run for Josh. Almost got out of that tackle. He's so big to be running, and yet he's triple threat. Taken off. Can he get there? Stiff arm to get there. First down. Well, damn. Tall Singletary left. Where the Bills just moving the line of scrimmage. Those lanes, man. The first pass. Caught by Diggs. Navigates the middle. And Stephon Diggs will get down to the 15 yard line. Catches right here. They empty it out on third down. Singletary in the open field. Good job to make the first man miss. Get low. Inside the 10-yard line. First and goal. Bill's driving for the lead. And Allen throws. Tutty. And inside. Isaiah McKenzie. Time to pass. His hooks are good. His kicks are hooking. Walk it down the field on the ground. And then Josh no. Allen as well. This is an MVP year for Josh game. Allen. He is chased and flushed. He's not going to get to the sideline. Right. This really is an MVP year for him. He's got so much to prove, and yet last year is just even adding more fuel to the fire. Oh, great job by Puck. Just waited for it and brought it in. First down for the Rams. I mean, getting knocked off by Kansas City last year the way they did, man, that got to hurt somebody. But it's how you respond from a situation like that. He puts his shoulder down, and they'll mark him. They bring back Stafford. Look out. Vaughn. 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 It sets up 
Stafford, deep shot, middle of the field, Skoranek is going in the middle. Back up to the six, Allen out of his own end zone, thinking about taking off. Away from Ernest Jones, and he carries him out to the 13. After the gate of eight, Zach Moss runs left. I'll tell you one thing, McDermott knows how to use his quarterback. Takes him, Rams 11. He doesn't use him too much, he uses him just yeah, enough to be effective. Added up the point of attack. Knocks the tight end in motion. Allen look off and come there it is. to the middle. And Jameson That's a good though. Three guys that side, and they get a block. Allen got rid of it. It's complete for the first down. It's Crowder again working inside. Second and ten. Allen decides to keep it this time and almost wish phoning him. Mm. As he gains two to three yards, this can't bring the big guy to the ground. Start the fourth. Roger Saffold back in, and Allen hangs it, throws it deep. Davis, is Gabe, Gabe Davis brought it in to the six-yard line. Davis sets up first and goal. They go. Why would you blitz on that? And he's at the backfield, going to keep it himself and throw on the run for Diggs. Third and goal. Allen keeps it, pumps, runs. Breaks the play. <laughs> <Touchdown Buffalo. laughs> Josh Allen took care of it himself. That's a good touchdown right there, man. Bobby did everything he could, everything technically right with Bobby. Stafford and company down 14 now. Swinging out to Powell. The kickoff return, man. He gets right around the market. He'll get the first down. No gain. Second and 10. Here's Cooper Cup. The coop chants are a little faint. Zero, snap away. Stafford throws and caught by the tight end to the first down for Tyler Higby. 43. Stafford throws are coming. It's high and it's intercepted. Off the deflection. It's one of those. That's not what you want. Jordan Poyer. Especially when you're down like this. It's only 151 yards. Design run Allen. Jordan Fuller comes in. Four. Allen stepping up. And now floating it downfield and digs it behind the secondary. Stumbles, but brings it in. And this is the shit that I be talking about with Jalen Ramsey. Jalen does all this talking. He's talked since he came into the league when he got baptized by Steve Smith Sr. And yet, Jalen doesn't back it up when he's going up against the number one receiver. Jalen talks all this shit and makes plays when he's going up against the third or fourth receiver on the depth chart. I... I don't, it's not that I don't dislike Jalen, Jalen Ramsey. I just think Jalen bites off more bites off more than he can chew. And there are times where he gets burnt. And I know you're not going to play your best game every game, but Jalen talks like he is all world, all pro. He's all pro, but they, he talks like he's a Hall of Famer already. That's that's just my thing. Jalen talks so much and never, ever, ever ever backs it up. Okay, he backs it up against A.J. Green. but that's And A.J. Green whooped his ass. Up. But that's beside the point. The point is, Jalen just talks way too much shit. Just play, bro. Just, just fucking play. If you get burnt, you and then you, if you get burnt one play, and all of a sudden you make a stop, and you make a breakup on the next play, like, come on. Don't need to celebrate, bro. Just play. You get your ass whooped. You're down to, what now, 30 to 10? You ain't got to talk, bro. Just play. Humble yourself a little bit. That's all I got to say about that. Buffalo touchdown! And no, I'm not saying I'm against trash talk. I talk trash. I talk a lot of trash. But I also know when to shut the fuck up when I'm getting my ass whooped. Okay? If, you, if you're beating us 30 to 10, 31 to 10, I ain't got no room to talk. But if I see one of, if I see one of my DBs do this or this or the, that shit, and we're down 31 to 10, your ass is getting benched. You will not see the field for weeks. Because why are you doing that for, bro? Just, we're getting our ass whooped. We got to get back in the game. Like, come on. Be smart. Tyler Bass makes it 31 to 10. Target is that guy. Only one catch tonight, one target. So we got in the backfield, Darrell Higgerson Jr., nice catch. See? Third and 10 from 23. Stafford again hit as he throws underneath the tight end Higby. To be a couple shy of the first down. Yeah, we'll have to have it. And Henderson runs inside. Nowhere to go. Oh, barely got that. Dane Jackson for a second looked like he was going to stop him. And their pace. They get sacks. <laughs> Long night. 
Tyler Higby, open field tackles me. This is deflected in the air, a third and Go, big fella. Go, go, go. Oh, Stafford with the tackle. It, but another Rams turnover. And Allen on the bootleg. He's taking off and he's running for more. <laughs> He's and the Rams are going to lick on him. Hey, he runs like Shaggy from Scooby Doo. So let's get out of here, man. Moss trying to fight for the extra yards. We'll see who's got it on the bottom of the pile. Is to enjoy it. And if you don't, you hear it nine days or so of questions about what's going on with your team. The cup slides down, catches it, and it'll be done, it'll be done in about three and a half minutes. Ben Skoranek with the first down there. Teams in the NFL. There's a head coach. Some Three rip, years in uh, Minnesota, Higby catches this one. Uh, Tyler takes it for the first down to the third down. And that pass is cut one more time for a first down and more. Cooper cut. Big stats on the night. Good play. Stafford looking at end zone. Looking at the ground again. Last chance for the Rams. Stafford with an end zone shot. And incomplete to Robinson. Blouses. It's the sixth round rookie out of Villanova, Christian Benford. All right. What do I take from this game between the Bills and the Rams? The Bills are legit. Even coming into the season, I, I believe that they were on, they're on a mission to prove that they can get to the Super Bowl. They've been to the AFC Championship. Lost. Okay. Did they, did they get to the AFC Championship? I think they got to the AFC Championship. Yeah, I think they did about a year or two ago. Um, and then last year's debacle. So the momentum is in their way. Not in their way, but the momentum is there. They have a lot to prove. They've got some, they got Vaughn. They got pieces. Their defense is young and hungry. They're going to get Tredavious White back. It's going to be a movie for them. The Rams, I think offensively, they're predictable now. I think everybody knows what Sean McVay's offense can do and what they can do to stop it. A lot of motions, a lot of shifts, a lot of things that make the offense, the defense have to move with the shift and everything. So I, it's it, it's kind of predictable now. You've gotten the two Super Bowls now. It's time to reinvent the offense a little bit with Sean McVay. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not saying change the whole system. Stick to what you're good at, but reinvent it a little bit. Because he's supposed to be an offensive guru. And I, I, know, I believe in Sean McVay. I believe Sean McVay is one of the best coaches in the league. But... You gotta adjust. I don't think they've adjusted yet. I think they got a little bit of a Super Bowl hangover coming their way. But we'll see. We're gonna see. It's only week one. We're gonna see what happens down the road. But that's gonna be you guys. Comment down below what I should react to next. I know there's a lot more games coming this week. I gotta find a healthy balance between CFL games and select NFL games. So if you guys have any games you want me to react to NFL wise, please let me know in the comments section. I'm down to watch whatever. Also, I got CFL games coming this season, this evening. Not this evening, but you know what I mean. Tongue twist, I'm tired. <laughs> and I'm trying to get this video out. So I'm not probably talking straight, but it is what it is. And uh, if you got any CFL games that you want me to react to also as well, I'm down to watch those. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna get out of here. Um, keep, be safe, keep your head on a swivel. Tina Strive for Graces, all that good jazz. And we are up out of here.